Hi, welcome to Oakwood Amster. Today we'll be taking a look at this ODEC portable power bank, 20,000 milliamp capacity. And it's got a built in USB Type C port. I'm not sure when I ordered this. There's the warranty information, there's a user manual. If you want to read any part in more detail, just feel free to pause the video. Now, uh, here's the specs for it. Max power output, 18 watts. And it also supports quick charge too. So if I want to quickly charge my smartphone, I can. Or even use this to power one of those fast wireless chargers, I can do that as well. Before I get to the unit, let's see what else came in the box here. Came with the USB Type C to C cable already. I didn't know what came in it, so I actually brought my own here. It's got a textured surface on the top, just very just flat surface on the bottom. And on the back over here, the specs are printed again. Three out of four LED lit. The two USB Type A ports and the USB port here. It says in and out, so it's used to charge the unit too. Here we have my USB Type C dash cam, the one I made a video about recently. It's not showing it as charging for some reason. Let me just unplug it from here, reinsert it. Before brief, there's a brief moment when the lightning bolt appeared, but not right now. I've been using the auto battery for over a week now and don't really have much to complain about it. It's, it does exactly what I expected it to do. It's powerful enough to power all my USB devices. I can power the Nintendo Switch and charge it with this if I needed to. Actually, probably the only thing would be the USB type C in and out. I'm still getting used to that because when I use this to power some devices, it doesn't even really recognize it. Such as the, the dash cam I showed when I first did the unboxing of it. Uh, it's, to power my dash cam, I have to use the USB type A port. And as for charging it, it does take a while to charge if I were to use a lower watt charger. So definitely use a, a charger that's at least 18 watts or higher. That way it can charge overnight. If not, then we're looking at maybe two days, three days to fully charge this. If I were to use any like the this, this small one amp, like iPhone chargers. The unit's not light, but it is 20,000 milliamps. And because it's narrow enough for my kids to hold on to it. They love using this whenever they go out and play Pokemon Go. So overall, I do like this. I do find it very handy and I would recommend it. I'll place the link to the sign below. If you guys have any questions, comments, suggestions, feel free to contact me. Thanks for watching Uncle Hamster. Bye.